good morning friends happy Friday I hold on buddy okay hold on I want to start and say that the last month or so has been a really rough time for me for some reason I just have not been able to find my motivation I just don't care and that's a really hard thing for me because I really have goals and I have real reasons for the goals I have <coughs> so I've gotten a few uh, responses lately from my subscribers which there are a lot of new subscribers so welcome and thank you I'm sorry that the last few videos have been so scattered and uneventful um, <coughs> But I've gotten a lot of responses about going back and kind of watching my older videos, the ones that are really inspiring, my motivational ones. I have a vision board one. I have my um, <clears throat> kind of how to stay motivated. So plus I have a great group of friends, several very good friends that I have gotten from YouTube and just they speak to my heart and I spent yesterday watching a good chunk of videos of mine and reading comments and trying to refocus and yesterday last night I had a not last night yesterday afternoon I had a giant boost of inspiration and motivation and I spent yesterday afternoon meal prepping and menu planning and trying to just get my shit together because it is greatly needed <clears throat> so I am um, I feel really motivated to do great things I feel really motivated to get back at it and we're not going home honey I feel really good and ready to conquer the goals that I have set forth in front of me and right now it's just to lose the 15 or 16 pounds that I've gained in the last few months um, and just get back to feeling good I don't feel good because I am not where I need to be and I'm not focused and I'm not on plan so okay hold on please so of course the morning I decide to start is a morning that I'm on the road so for those of you who are wondering, I am going to stick with Simply Filling. I know that it works. I know that it is where I want to be. I just need to be accountable and I need to stay focused. I have been really thinking about going back to counting points and maybe I'll kind of double do it. Maybe I'll count my points just to see kind of where I am. But I know that Smart Points isn't where I want to be right now. I really enjoy doing Simply Filling. I like the food choices better. I like the I like the Simply Filling program. So I'm going to stick with it, and I'm going to make it work for me. But <laughs> this morning I am on the road. I did not feel like eating before we came out. So I grabbed a one Smart Point Muscle Milk. I am going to get a double shot of espresso over ice from Dunkin' Donuts um, and put my Muscle Milk in there and have that for breakfast. And maybe when I get home, I will have a snack um, if I feel like it. So that's kind of what I'm starting my morning out of, but I have done. I did chips. I made chips yesterday. I made salsa. I hard boiled some eggs. I cut up some veggies. I made a couple overnight oats. 
I made a big batch of the crack slaw or egg roll in a bowl last night um, for supper, so I have some of that left over for lunch today. Um, <clears throat> I have a menu plan for the next three or four days. Um, so I feel really good. I am headed to the store with my list. It is nice out. I'm really going to try to get out and walk with the kids for a little while every day. Even if it's just 15 or 20 minutes. My kids don't have the most um, attention span for being in our stroller. <coughs> but the road where we live... The cars are too fast for them to walk. So even if I can only get 15 or 20 minutes in, sorry, I have something in my throat, that will be better than nothing at all. So I'm gonna try to push and see what I can get out of them walk-wise and really just try to focus on me again for a while. So, We'll see what happens, but I will check back in when I get home. I'm not sure if I'm going to do a grocery haul or not. I actually don't need a whole lot of stuff. Um, some fresh fruit and just a few ingredients here and there for the recipes because I try to do recipes from stuff I already have at home. So we will see what happens this next couple of days, but I feel good. For the first time in a long time, I feel focused and ready to just do great things. So I will check back in with you guys in a little while. Have a good day. Bye friends. Hi guys. So it's about two o'clock and we didn't get home till about 1230. I've been putting stuff away putting my daughter for a nap, helping my son build a race car Lego. I am still drinking the cup of coffee that I got at Dunkin' this morning. It, I was going to put the muscle milk in it and I forgot it in the car. So this is just an iced hazelnut which is unsweetened. There was, excuse me, two Splenda and non-fat milk. I'm actually going to put some more ice in it and a little more non-fat milk and finish drinking that. I have not had anything yet to eat today. I'm not super starving. Oh, I lied. I had a banana in the car. So I have here one portion of the um, crack slaw or egg roll in a bowl. I'll try to link my recipe, my cook with me for it. I think I did just about the same thing. Um, no points. The only thing, there's lean extra lean ground beef, soy sauce, I put a squeeze of the gojujang and a little teeny tiny drizzle of sesame oil and a little sprinkle of sesame seeds. There's not enough to count any points. I got one portion I ate last night, two more of these, and my husband ate some last night when he got home. So um, I'm going to eat this for lunch and have my coffee and sit down and relax for a few minutes. I am very behind on water, so I'm also going to get a big cup of water and good start job. drinking that. See what I did? Nice. Good job. Okay, we'll see you guys later. Bye. Hi, guys. I got the one I killed. So it's about 6.30. And so far, sorry to be so close and personal, so far I have not had yeah. supper. Here you go. <clears throat> I don't know if it's the heat or what. I'm just not feeling that great. My stomach's really upset. And I'm kind of bummed because I made homemade french fries and Big Mac attack. I made my kids cheeseburgers. And I just cut a whole watermelon, which I've had a few pieces of that. But other than that, I'm really not hungry right now, so I'm just going to kind of sit on it and that stuff will be hot for the next little while and if I'm hungry, I'll have something and if not, I'm not going to feel too bad. Um, <clears throat> I didn't have a lot of footage today, so I think what I'm going to do is combine this 
with tomorrow because I don't know how much vlogging I'll actually be able to do tomorrow either. Um, the kids and I have a play date that will probably take up a good chunk of the day. Um, so I'm just going to combine the two days and hopefully it will be a decent sized vlog. So I'm not going to close out yet because I'm not really sure what's going to happen. But I have had two of these. This is my third one since I've been home. So I'm getting in my water today at least. Um, it's about 75 degrees here and I know that that doesn't seem hot to some people. But for us, two weeks ago, maybe not even two weeks ago, we were still like in the 30s. Plus I've had my oven on all afternoon, so I'm hot and uncomfortable and just... So I will check back in if I have anything to eat. Good morning friends, happy Saturday. So, feeling a little better than I was yesterday. Um, I already had breakfast. I will include a screenshot of that in here. Sorry I'm in the same shirt as yesterday. I have not got dressed yet. Um, <clears throat> I just filled a second cup of bottle of water and I'm still working on my zero, no count cup of coffee. Um, <clears throat> for breakfast I had one package of the original instant grits which are simply filling I had one teaspoon of I can't believe it's not butter light in there for zero smart points <clears throat> yes you do I had one egg and a bowl of watermelon so so far so good I am getting ready to pack up a lunch for our picnic um, I think I know what I'm going to bring for myself, but I'm not quite sure yet. Um, so I will let you know, or at least show you when I get it all ready. I just put two very large chicken breasts, they are frozen, in my crock pot with a packet of ranch seasoning and a half a cup of Sweet Baby Ray's buffalo sauce. So this is four points for the half a cup. and. The ranch seasoning is very controversial. Um, I know some people count it and some don't. Some say, oh, well, it's a seasoning. But yeah, I know that it has ingredients that are points. So I know the whole packet is six smart points, which makes my whole crock pot nine smart points. So depending on how many servings I get out of it, I think I will just count each serving as one smart point. <coughs> Um, so not too bad. I don't know what I'm going to have with it yet. Maybe some sweet potato fries or something. We had homemade french fries last night for supper. I didn't really eat any of them, but I don't think my crew will want that again. Um, maybe I'll just have some rice or some quinoa or something, but I am going to make the, um, taco quinoa bake sometime in the next couple of days. So I don't know. My day is kind of up in the air right now, but I'm going to put the lid on my crock pot and let that cook while we are out having fun. And I'm getting ready to start my day. So I hope you all have a great day. As you can see, it is sunny here. Yesterday it got up to about 75 degrees, which for this area is really hot. Um, like I said in yesterday's vlog, I think less than a week ago, it was like 35 degrees. Can you show him where his Lego is, please? No. Yes, please. Okay, I gotta go. Bye, guys. Hi, friends. So, I'm just getting back from the park, and I didn't eat all of my lunch, so I figured I would show you what was left in here. So, this is what I have left. Just some vegetables. Um, broccoli, cauliflower, carrots... I made a banana wrap. I took the tomorrow's low in carb honey wheat wrap, which is, I think they're one smart point a piece or simply filling. I made two tablespoons of the PB Fit, put that down, and then I 
laid the banana down and rolled it up and cut it into pieces and then I just sprinkled it with just a few pieces of unsweetened coconut so I'm not counting that so one point for all of that for the PB2 and then we snacked on watermelon um, I brought I brought a bag of slim fast chips to eat but as you can see they're still full I didn't eat those so I did pretty well I feel pretty good the kids played it's super super windy out so we battled the wind but I'm actually gonna eat the rest of that um, because I'm hungry and I'll see you guys later bye hello my friends so it is finally supper time it's about 6 30 and I'm just barely getting hungry so I think this is like my sixth bottle of water today I've been really really thirsty so I have on the bottom just a bed of leftover brown rice and quinoa that I had both in my fridge I just mixed them up because um, I only had a little bit left of each so that's on the bottom maybe maybe a third of a cup then I have a little bit of the chicken that's been cooking in the crock pot all day um, in the little bit of buffalo sauce and the ranch packet so I'm gonna count one point for the chicken and then over here I just have some sauteed pea pods that I sauteed in a little olive oil salt pepper and garlic powder that's it um, so just one point for dinner today and one point for the PB2 that I had for lunch so two points for today um, I had a good day it was busy but it was good um, I probably won't eat anything else tonight but I will come back and say goodnight bye guys